excited for 2023 when well, I'm recording this video from Southern California in Los Angeles and right now is an hour 15 minutes left until 2023 who's ready but for me I just actually got back from Orange County and my hair has got wet right here and if you're not sure in Ca Southern California has been raining for the last few days and this is really weird size and everybody sometimes hate the rents but I think for me it's the great things that has been raining so it's bringing all the negative energies and something bad you know leave behind and you always know after the rain there's a rainbow and actually tomorrow will be the first day of 2023 and tomorrow going to be sunny on the first so that is something positive that we're looking to and can wait for it for me personally um i know that 2022 wasn't that great for me because you know i was really sick and then you know there's so many things that happened that actually make me feel depressed but i just look back at 2022 right now and feel grateful for what i've been through because of that and it made me become a stronger person so, uh, not only in finance also career mindsets and also relationship and whatever actually um go, went through and those consider obstacles and obstacle owns also are the ways for us to change and as long as we take it and the different mindsets so for me um just one reminder for all of us even though there's something that we haven't achieved in 2022 we actually can look at it in a different way to see how those things touch us to become a person where we're standing right now to create it and bring it to 2023 make it a different way and even a better way to you know put that into a different plans different goals and we actually can start with a new strategy new me new us and even like wiser right so i know that 2023 if you calculate it's number seven and number seven is actually a positive change for all of us there's some people who actually achieve whatever they want because they have been building those things for the last few years and just ready for that for some people you know this year might be uh, something that you need to step one step back to actually work on yourself a lot of energy on personal growth so you can ready for upcoming future so stay tuned and don't feel it's bad or not you know going well for you but there's up and down for everybody each year and that is just make who we are and for me i i feel really you know excited also i usually haven't celebrated any new years for the last two years when i live in la because last year i got COVID during around december and i was staying home and this year i was you know kind of healthy went out and even met some friends before uh, new year eve and right now it's actually you know a couple hours left it's for fireworks and you know i'm grateful for that because of my health So I have this to share with you. It's kind of interesting what my friend shared to me about a couple days ago about numerology. So you can actually understand how your day of birth aligns with the number 2023, everything together. And I will make sure to attach this link on my bio so you can take a look yourself to actually understand, you know, what's, what's up for the next year. Um, first of all, 2022 was a six year. So you can calculate 222 is number six, and that is was the six years meaning it was all about building new relationships and strengthening the people already in your life but 2023 adds up to number seven and the energies is instead asking us to look inward now we have grow in tendons with others we need to step back and see how ourselves have changed in response to the growth 2022 asks us where are we different how has our outlook changed it's safe to say that many of us have experienced internal shifts as the world acclimates to the new abnormal. And now is the moment to get clear regarding those changes. Unless that you think you know yourself, perhaps you have alters in the ways you didn't even realize. Sometimes in order to progress change, we must be confronted with it directly. And that is what this year is all about. 
We have collective opportunity to come to terms with ourselves and develop a better understanding of the ways we involve while we are just living our lives. A new you has been slowly forming when you didn't even realize it. Now is the time to fully integrate that existence and go forward with a strong sense of awareness. This progress won't occur overnight, but that's okay. The seven energy is not one to be rushed, more slowly. Move slowly, dipping your toe in to test the waters with each step until you fully immerse yourself in this year with this sea of opportunity. Goals for 2023. First, make yourself a priority. Self-care is our priority. It's time to nurture yourself with the time and care you might be have previously denied yourself. We are living in a strange world no matter the circumstances. It can be difficult to push ourselves forward on a continuous basis. So this is a year to make sure you end burning out. Keep your spiritual and emotional reserves safely secure. Second, gain greater clarity. You are going to have a lot of you break up moments in 2023 as you come to understand your yourself better and why you behave the way you do. Focus on getting the roots of the matters and examining how these core issues have impacted your life thus far. It's time to highlight your strengths and weed out your weaknesses. Third, contemplate oneness. Building connections between yourself and the natural world is very important this year. There's a lot to be gained by tapping into the energy that pervades all manner of life and seeing how we are linked together. No person in an island and it's time for us to realize that more than ever. Four, listen to your inner voice. Intuition is the major of this year, seven year, and learning to trust yourself on one more instinctual level is a part of this. Make the point to follow your guts more often, and if you have trouble listening to it, then put a focus on getting more in touch with your instincts. They know what's right for you. So how to calculate your personal year in 2023, you can read more in depth on the articles. Why the number seven is universal year? We impact everybody through 2023. The influence you will most directly comes from your personal number year. Calculating your, per your personal year's number is really easy. Simple look at the day of your birth in 2023. Then add each digit together. If you end with a double digit number as your son, and add those digits together as well until you come up with a single digit. And for example, if you was born in November 20, your birthday in 2023 will be 11, 20, 2023. Create an additional problem with each digit in that day. So you fill everything together and that is actually number 11. Add again until you get a single digit. So one plus one is two. So your personal number is for 2023 would be number two, right? So from that, you can just basically continue reading and get your number for that. One last thing I would like to say today before I end this video. Well, you are strong, you are powerful, you are brave for the life that you've been trying to achieve. You will carve for it no matter what. Maybe no one saw it. You only see that yourself and you know what you've been through every day. Even though someday you was lazy, you don't want to get up to go to work or certain things in your life that happen that blocking you just wake up, do your things. Well, proud of yourself for pushing yourself out of the bubble and make it to the end of the year. And just keep that mindset and then change and appreciate and then moving forward to see what are you trying to achieve? What are you trying to accomplish in 2023 in order to actually change your life in a better way, in more healthy way, positive way? Doesn't matter what it is, you know your goals. And I wish you all the great 2023 with a positive mindset, a joy, happiness, and also a big appreciation every day, no matter what you've been through. 
And with that, Happy New Year! And take a moment to plan out if you haven't had a chance to do so, to put out the goals on the paper and knock it out, knock it out in 2023, and go out there, make your life with the better, and enjoy the heck out of it. Peace.